Oh, yeah, Bob. I made a lot of great memories here at Wild River Country that closed down in 2019. But I remember vividly the excitement that I had as a kid when coming up this driveway because I knew that that meant that it was time for some fun. But coming soon, that feeling that filled this place with happiness will be back when the brand spanking new Miley Entertainment Center comes to town. On Crystal Hill Road in North Little Rock, you'll find keep out signs, barricades, and locked gates to what was a heck of a good time. Remember going as a kid, that was a big thing. Like, I'm from Pine Bluff, so coming to Little Rock, going to Wild River Country was big for me. In 2019, the Wild River Country shut down. But new memories can soon be made with the Maui Entertainment Center that's set to be here at the end of 2023. It's a perfect location to, to help everybody from Maumelle, Central Arkansas, Little Rock, North Rock, it's going to be very valuable. The $28 million project will bring 200 jobs and enough annual revenue to make North Little Rock Mayor Terry Hartwick pass out hugs. Upwards of $10 million per year. <laughs> There will be two sections of fun, tea time golf and hyperlanes bowling, the mixture bringing a new vibe. To me, it looks like something that we can take our kids to that's not Dave and Buster's or Chuck E. Cheese. I know we have a bunch of stuff up in northwest Arkansas, but it's nice to see some of that coming down here. Mayor Hartwick says 30 years ago, he was one of the first to jump in the water at Wild River Country when it opened, and he has a request for the Miley Entertainment Center. I want to be the first to take that first swing if I could, okay? <laughs> and in two or three months, crews will begin cleaning and clearing this place out to get ready to start building, which is scheduled to start next spring. And the full project is expected to be done by the end of 2023. Reporting live in North Little Rock, Gary Burton Jr., KRK4 News. All right.